10 days in, 50 to go. I am rank five on the Trailblazer League Reloaded, and I'm not stopping here. More tasks and more grinding and more points to get. Let's get right into it. So apparently everyone and their mother has been boosting soul wards and pest control for free combat XP, and I had no idea. And that's how so many of my competitors are already 9-9 in their combat stats. Soul wards got capped to 1 mil XP a day now, but some people already took advantage of it before it got patched. And people with Asgarnia for pest control are all basically already maxed. I'm a bit late to the party, but I'm going to do Soul Wars for two hours now to stack up some zeal, and we'll be able to claim that XP every single day. Okay, and that is all my Soul Wars boosting done. Just around 6,000 tokens, a little bit less. Um, is this going to get me? No, it's not. Is that going to get me? No, it's not. 81 Prayer, which is also base level 80s, which is 200 points right there, getting me to 44,000. Nice. I'm going to use the rest on strength, I think. X tokens, five, seven, one, four. Oh, you, there's a cap, right? And what strength level is this? Like, that, that gets me to 86 strength. Okay, I'm capped out. Please wait a day before claiming any more experience from Soul Wars. All good with me. 44,000 points. I'm going to bed. All right, let's purchase an Ectoplasm or two because that's 80 points right there that I just had saved up. 44,080. Now let's go do some mining. Sleep for six hours, edit for four hours. I'm losing 10 hours every day. You know how it is. We're at rank seven right now. We've fallen two ranks, 44,000 points, but it's time to start doing some clues and hopefully we can get back to rank five and maybe even push for rank four today. I'm sponsoring today's video with my own merch. I launched it especially for leagues with some sick designs. And if you want to go the extra step in supporting me, buying my merch is the best way. I've got a pack watch and troll face and DB branded coffee mugs, hoodies, crew necks, hats, beanies, and more that can all be at your doorstep within the week. So please consider checking it out at didabitter.com. Any purchase directly supports me. Okay, it's time to work on some clues and then I'll do something AFK when I go eat again, like catching 100 sharks. Let's start with beginner clues. I need to fill the entire collection log slot. How much have we done of that is the question. 10 out of 16. And I also need to gain 35 unique items for beginner clues, which will give me another 25 points. All right, let's get started. Training Fletchin while I do this, I need to get to 92 and 95 Fletchin eventually, which is a big ass, but we'll get it done. Already on 17 caskets, my video is almost done rendering. When it is and my food's here, I'll open all the caskets and we'll go catch some sharks or something. All right, we've got 20 beginner caskets, so let's open them. What do we need to get? We need to get six items and 35 uniques. Let's just pull the six items right now. Boom, boom, boom. Ooh, I got a reward casket and a rune skimitor ornament kit. Is that one of the items? I do believe it is, nice. Oh, it got me an easy casket too, cool. That's really cool, mole slippers. Rune Skimitar uh, Zamorak kit. I think I needed all that. Jester cape. Let's just bank all of that. Um, oh my god, are you serious? I don't have space. Let me release any placeholders that I have. Boom. Boom. Ooh, I think I'm doing really good, actually. I just need the amulet, the monk robe top, and the sandwich lady hat. Boom. Boom. Damn it. Come on. Two more. Okay, what do we get to? Yeah, okay, we need... To, ooh, I got the Sandwich Lady hat. I just need the Amulet Defense and the Monk's Rope Top. I'm gonna go catch some sharks now while I eat and upload this video from yesterday. Ooh, there we go. There's Clients of Karen and Ghost Ahoy done. Those are some tasks that were bugged. 44,130 points, just like that. All right, and that's Catch 100 Shark, 80 points right there. 44,210. Let me go claim my lamps from the combat achievements and we'll get back to beginner clues. Yeah, this is an antique lamp. What's it for? Ooh, I can put in anything? Why did I just click range? Am I trolling? Put it in mining, 240k XP. All right, let's get back to beginner clues and fletching. Okay, let's open these 10 caskets real quick and we will see if we can complete this log. Luckily, somehow. Boom, 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 boom. Oh. I don't think we got anything new. Did we? No, we did not. All right, let's just open these 10 caskets while we're running. I don't need to save any of the stuff. Ooh, gain 35 unique items from beginner clues. That's one of them. Nice. It's 80 points getting us to four. What is that? Four, four, two, 90. Let's just keep opening. I think we might have just gotten one of them. No, we didn't. Otherwise, we would have got a big pop-up. Yeah, we're still hunted for the monk ribs top and defense hammy. Uh, let's open these 13, bro. Ooh, I got the monk rope top. I just need one thing now. I just need the amulet. Come on, dude. Did I get it? I did not. 
ten more caskets, dude. Give me this amulet. Nope. Eleven more caskets. Oh, we got it! We filled every beginner clue collection log slot on our first one, dude. And that's 40 points for equipping a trimmed amulet. 44,530. Let's just open all of these anyway, because why not? Boom. I don't even know what they had in them. Next up is Elite Clues. I need to fill 25 slots in its collection log, as well as gain 25 unique items. It's a big combo breaker that has over 400 points for us. I have seven Elite Clue caskets. Let's see what they got. We need 25 uniques and 25 collection log slots. Any chance we get them from seven? We got a Shazian Scar. I think that's the only new one from that. Um, Blacksmith Helm? That's got to be new. Dragon Chain Body Ornament Kit? That has to be new. Blue Fire Lighter? Probably not new. A Reward Casket? I just got a Giant Boot. I got a Master Clue. That's nice. Dragon Leg Slash Skirt Ornament Kit and the Light Tuxedo Shoes? Yeah, we definitely take that. Okay, that's Phil Ten Elite Clue Collection Log Slots. That's 80 points. I forgot about that one. Cheeky little 80 points, getting us to 44, 6, 10. Open another one. Dragonstone Bracelet. Dark Infinity Color Kit. I don't know if there's anything new from that. We got a deer stalker too. I don't even know what that is. Uh, Fell the pips. A monocle? Damn. Okay. Cool. What are we at? That's definitely an. Oh, I gained 25 unique items as well already. Damn. 13 out of 59. You think it'll be easy to get 25 slots? I got the 25 unique items. Yeah, let's open these five elite caskets anyway. We're looking for some extra caskets and some unique items. Sagicus Spectacles. Master Clue, Dragon Sim Ornament Kit, Royal Gown Bottom, Bucket Helm, Dragon Square Ornament Kit. Oh, this is a lot of items, I feel like. Uh, that was nothing. Damn, I got hella Master Clues, dude. We game. I've got 20 out of the 25, and I've got 19 Elite Clues done. What the hell? Alright, I've got three caskets. I'll open them once I'm out of bank. Dude, I didn't even record any of it either, dude. Oh my god, I'm a bum, dude. Oh my. <laughs> I just opened... Yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna do a voiceover or whatever. I just opened three of those clues. I got one unique item, so that wasn't too great. Let's go do two more, and then we'll get the task for that. And hopefully we can pull five uniques and two clues, you know? Simple. Black Dead Body Trimmed and Ancient Page 2, dude. And another master clue. Bruh. That's another shared one, huh? 21 out of 59. Come on, four uniques. Ooh, no. That was 25 elite clue scrolls done, though. I don't know why I got hyped up for no reason, dude. 44,890 points. I literally didn't get a single unique. One casket. I got a holy blessing, bro. Isn't that shared, too? Come on. I got nothing, bro. I got a briefcase. I got one item, dude. Three more to go. All right, another casket. Can we get four collection log slots at once? Bro. One more casket. Iron dragon mask. Two more slots now. All right, can we pull two slots? Ooh, we can. Fill 25 elite clue collection log slots. I got the Archaea scarf. And the Steel Dragon Mask. We're done. Thank God. I was not having fun. 45,090 points. I need to get 12 more easy slots. That's easy, bro. That's what they call easy. 91 Fletchen. Okay, can our luck turn around and can we open? Can we pull 12 collection log slots and 5 casket slots? Steel Plate Legs G. Oh, Black Wizard Robe, Blue Elegant Legs, Steel Kite Shield T, Iron Kite Shield G, Black Plate Body, Black Helm Blue Skirt, Black Plate Legs. Dude, I just got so many things. I'm one off, damn. Damn. Oh, my bank is so full, dude. Boom. Oh, wow, dude. <laughs> I got nothing. But this is it. What? Wait, is it? Yeah, it is. 50 easy clue collection log slots. 200 points. 45,290. I gotta go make some space in my bank, dude. Can I? There's no way I can use these all on prayer. Damn. Lost me to 85 prayer. 
I want to get 120 combat eventually for 200 points, and I want to get 90 prayer so I can start working on base level 90s and 200, 200 total, 2,200 total, and uh, max as well eventually. All right, that is 90 prayer. I'm going to stop here because I want to use my zeal for more prayer or something. I don't know, bro. Who knows? Oh my god, this cat just jumped into my backyard again. What the hell? But uh, we need to get four more combat levels for 120 combat. Oh, he's right fucking here, bro. Please work, please work, please work, please work. Let's go, we try and feed it a stray dog something exotic, dude. That's disgusting, you can't give it to the poor dog. <laughs> I still need to kill 150 spindle for a 200 point task, and I also need to get the Void Waker piece, which I haven't got, so I can make the Void Waker for 200 points. When I was using Mage, I was killing it very, very quickly, but I do need to train my melees as well. So I'm going to use the Yersin Chain Mace and start getting around 1.38 mil XP an hour. All right, that is 87 strength. I'm getting 1.5 mil strength XP an hour right now, so I'll take it. I don't know how long it's going to take to do 150 kills. I already got that. It's the fan of it out. I got it. I got it. I need the Void Waker piece. Hmm. Me? A pro? Red spider eggs! Pog! 89 strength! Another deep pickaxe on 159 KC. We're still hunting that Void Waker piece. Well, I just got nice strength speaking of melee. It's nice. Red spider eggs! Ooh, more red spider's eggs. Shit. More red spider eggs, bro. How many do we have in our looting bag? A thousand. D2H, let's go. Okay, I've been training on attack now. I just got to 87 attack, 118 combat. Two more combat levels and we get 200 points. We're getting 120 combat. Okay, I just got 90 attack and 119 combat a second ago. Just gonna train my attack and melees up a little bit more to get 120 combat. I don't know if I'll get the 300 KC before I get 120 combat actually. 14 more kills, bro. And there's another Void Waker piece I do not have. Okay, and that is my third hundred Venezanas kill. We did not get the Void Waker piece. It is what it is. 200 points. We're very, very close to 120 combat either. Don't have the Void Waker piece from Callisto because we did all those kills when the drops are still bugged. And we don't have the Void Waker piece from Venezanas either. I'm just going to do some melee Wilderness Slayer now. Still want to get the 120 combat. And it's probably the best way to do it because I can use the Chain Mace. Did I just hit a 69? I need to see what I can hit with a spec. That's the real question. Sorry if you can hear the birds. I have all the windows down right now. 79. Boom. One hit. Or two hits. Sorry. You guys hate it when I say that. We're already at 92 strength. I'm going to change it onto attack because it'll probably be a quicker level. All right. That's my task done. I am 180k XP off that level. I'm going back to spend All right. That is 91 attack and 120 combat. Gets me to 45,770 points. I don't know if I'm going to stay here for the whole task. I've done a lot of spindle today. And we do still not have that Void Waker piece. I'm getting out of here. All right, let's get 99 farming real quick. Boom, 88 farming. Let's do this all the way. That got us all the way to 94 farming off one inventory. Let's do another one. Okay, we're doing the U saplings now. Still a lot of XP. 97 farming, two more levels, and my dragon fruit saplings and stuff have growing. All right, what XP drop is going to be this? That's the real question. 277k, goddamn. I want the dragon fruit too. And that should be 99 farming, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, quick and easy. That was the fastest 99 I've ever gone. Reach level 99 farming, another 200 points, 45,970. I'm going to make 100 pies next. And I'm also going to boost my thieving, so I'm going to make some dragon fruit pies. So I'm going to go buy a bunch of pot of flowers and whatever else I need to make pies. Making 20 red berry pies is going to be 80 points. Making 100 pies is going to be 80 points. But first, I'm going to make 200 dragon darts. All right, that's the dragon fruit pie make. This should boost my fletching. It does. Let's go. And that is fletching 200 dragon darts for 200 points, getting me over 46,000 for the first time. 46,170 points. Okay, I just made 100 pastry doughs. Love making pies. I think now we can just use... Oh, I don't even have red berries. Let me go pick 100 red berries. Forgot about that part. Oh, wait, no. At first, I need to make these into pie dishes or some shit. I'll do that. Then I'll get the red berry. Alrighty, I've made the pie shells. I need to go get 20 red berries now. Maybe I'll get 30 as well because I only have 70 dragon fruit. 
and I need to make 100 pies in total. Allegedly, this red berry push never runs out of red berries, so that should be nice. All right, that should be enough. I need the cooking cape so I don't burn any of these dragon fruit pies. Okay, let's get started. Let's make some red berry pies first. And that is a hard task, cook 20 red berry pies. It was very, very hard indeed. 46,250 points. Well, I guess I gotta cook the rest of these because I made them into pies. Let's cook 100 pies. We did some red berries, we did some dragon fruit. 46,330. The boy Maz has creeped up onto the high scores, but for now, just for now, we're above him. All right, I only got another 180 snapdragons. That's not enough. Okay, I'm not gonna be able to get 99 herbless, so maybe I'm gonna work on doing all of the Dagonoth King's achievements. There are only three Dagonoth King combat achievements I have left to do to gain 200 points. I have to kill all three DKs within nine seconds of the first one dying, which should be pretty easy. I just need to lower them all below 20% and use the Executioner's Axe. I also need to kill Rex and another DK at the same time, which I imagine I can just barrage stack them. And I need to kill Prime with a Rune Throne Axe spec bounced off of Rex. So I just need to lower Prime to very low HP and then hope the spec hits on Rex. Okay, I'm gonna kill them all within nine seconds of killing the first one because that's probably the easiest one and then we'll do the rest. Okay, I don't even think I recorded that, but I just did rapid succession. I'm an idiot. But uh, yeah, I just used the axe. I got them all under 20% and I just one hit them with the axe, which is pretty nice. I'll try and record these axe too. Ooh. Okay, I did it from one king to another. Let's go. Now I just need to kill two at the same time. Okay, I'm going to try and barrage one and axe the other. Don't know how that's going to go, but I feel like it should go well. Come on, please. Oh my god. Okay, we're trying to go off distance. Bro, what? Finally, bro. Oh my god, that took way longer than it should have. 200 points for completing all the combat achievements for the Dagonoth Kings. 46,530. I still need an imbued heart, and I also want to train my melee stats, so I'm kind of just blowing Slayer points to get a task that I want to do. I'm super tired, and I want to go to bed. So if I'm not barraging something or training my melees, I don't want to do it. I still really need an imbued heart, and I'm super dry for it, so hopefully we get it. I've already killed over 50 superior monsters, which is definitely within the drop rate of it. Another superior, any chance of imbued heart? How am I so dry for one? Just toss it this way. I beg. I beg. Nope. Abyssal demons, please get an imbued heart. Going in. Superior right away, come on. Come on. Imbued fart. Please. Damn it. Come on, give me the give me the imbued fart. Please. Nope. Alright, that's that toss done. Still no imbued fart. Alright. I skipped Greater Demons once, I'm not gonna skip it again. Just gonna melee it, get my stats up. Alright, that's that task done. I'm going to bed. Started off the video at rank seven and ended at rank seven. I think me sleeping six to seven hours a night has been pretty detrimental to the rank grinding process. I can't just go 40 hours in a row like I used to. I'm 22, man. I'm getting old. A lot of slow points today, but hopefully that means tomorrow will come with some quicker ones. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it. And if you want to support me further, as well as keep yourself clothed, go to didabitter.com and buy something for my merch. Thank you guys so much for watching.